Hi everyone, I'm out in Port Lethen today, speaking to people in and around the Jubilee Hall about matters that are really impacting on them. A lot of residents have contacted me, they're worried about the impact of increased housing and local service provision. There's a real challenge that locals are facing here in terms of resourcing facilities which are increasingly struggling. The Tory Lib Dem Council at Aberdeenshire that are responsible for council-led facilities are really, in all the cuts that they're making, increasing the pressure on an increased population which on the one hand is good, but facilities and community-based facilities like the Jubilee Hall, like the Porter Cabin, like the Men's Shed, need to be sustained and resourced. That's what it's about today as far as I can see in terms of the local agenda and it's great to be here. Hi everyone, I'm in Port Lethen today and I wanted to say something about the fantastic service that there is behind me. The Forty Cabin or the Larder is such a fantastic resource locally. I've worked there as a volunteer myself. I've seen the women and the men that go there that actually volunteer their time to make such a difference to the local community. In terms of the fantastic management, I couldn't suggest that it's anything other than totally professional and excellent. Well, well provided for by local businesses, whether they're butchers, bakers, the grocers, it's such a really well resourced facility. It's the best example of the way forward in terms of the very necessary provision for a food bank in an area like this. I've got a lot of experience with the men's sheds in and around the northeast of Scotland. One of those that I've noticed recently on my trips out to Port Lethen has been the men's shed here. What a fantastic resource it is. I pay absolute tribute and give due credit to the trustees and the working that, that is behind the men's shed in Port Lethen. Not least since the pandemic, it's vital for mental health and well-being, for inclusion, but also bringing people men, women, young and old into the men's sheds to share skills and expertise. This is a fine example of the way that men's sheds should be operated. And as your MP, I'll be having special regard and interest in the future of the men's shed in an area such as Port Lethen.